you know, you see, you see the pimps mm -hmm. in, in videos and you know, yeah. documentaries, and, and it looks like a glamorous life. Uh -huh. But, you know, if you study it, you realize it's one of the most stressful things yeah. that you could possibly man, do. I mean, man. <laughs> <yeah>. <laughs> and, and this is, I mean, you got to, you got to understand something. You know, here it is. You got multiple women. Okay, these bitches got different birthdays. They both, uh, favorite food is different. They like different shit on the radio. Um, some of them got kids and shit. Some of them got kids that live far, far out. Some of them got kids just across state. It might be their birthday or the mother's birthday. And here you are. That, that You know, that's why they say, you know, a real pimp don't get no sleep because, um, you know, them bitches constantly need shit. You know what I mean? And you got to be willing to, okay, bitch, come on. You know what I mean? Right, because I think what people don't realize is that you actually are in a relationship At, with exactly. each and every one of these women. Exactly, exactly, man, exactly. Yeah. I mean, you can't have a stable full of hoes and, you know, think you can have, you know, this square girlfriend on the side who <laughs> may have, it's like a regular job. Them, all that money will walk away from you. It's just not something that go with that. You know what I mean? By law, uh, this is a no-no. Yeah. And, you know, uh, it, it could uh, 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 snatch a stripe or two up off your, your pimping and, and, uh, right. and shit like that. And the women you're dealing with, these aren't, you know, stable middle-class women with nice upbringings. A lot of times they have damaged backgrounds. They have... A lot of them got the same story. Which is? Damaged backgrounds. Yeah. Shit like that. Abused you know? by, by right, family right. members, yeah, that, yeah. that type of thing. Right, right, right. And you, you know you you uh uh you know you know I used to have this saying same bitch different shirt. <laughs> because uh but then you have good hoes that will uh uh a uh, uh, step before a college professor every day, um, who got a phlebotomy license, or who is a paralegal and will do some hoeing when nightfall comes. Yeah, man. I mean, for everyone who's looking at this saying that they want to be a pimp, look at, you know, one of the most difficult relationships you've had with a woman, now multiply that by six at the same time. No, it's different. It's different than that. Different than that? Mm -hmm. Explain. It's more pleasant than that. Okay. It's way more. You get more joy out of it than that. Okay. You can't compare that to that. Okay. No. Hell Fair no. enough. That's a, it's another kind of bad, right? It's the kind of bad that your square cat's bad. He would want to trade you his bad. <laughs> <laughs> right, for the okay. pimp's bad, right? You see right. what I'm saying to you? By a long shot, too. Yeah. So, so from the the point that you were you started pimping at 17, to to the time that you eventually quit, did you ever have a regular girlfriend? A regular? No. Or, never. No. Weren't interested. It's the last thing you want. You, you know. She would have no idea idea of how seasoned you are up here, but she would feel it, you know, but wouldn't be able to put her finger on it, even if you tell her. Mm -hmm. So whenever you talk to a woman, the only thing you're interested in is, can she be a hoe? Can she make you some money? You're not interested in her. There's no question of can she be. I could spot a hoe and I could sit right here, just open the window. <laughs> I could tell you that bitch is a hoe. Yeah. I mean, you know, it's about how they walk. How they sit down, how they stand up, uh, talk. It's, it's things that tell you, you see how? I mean, when you look at all the girls that, that you were pimping over the years, how many of them did you actually turn out versus they were already hoes and they just chose you? If you look at percentages. You know, a few, a few. But, you know, the first turnout is always the most thrilling? Most, to me. Yeah. Yeah, the first turnout. What do you think was the most difficult part of that? You know, because were you getting busted every so often? No. Or, or, no? Never. Never got busted for pimping? No. 
Okay. It's a rarity, because you know I read a lot of other pimps. Pimps don't get busted for pimping. Pimps get busted for miss pimping. Okay, so you never were miss pimped. Miss pimped. No, I haven't. Never. Never. It's not on my record. So girls Nowhere. never turned on you? They never no. reported you to police? Nothing. No. Because you got to be good to these women. I didn't had I didn't have females, mamas, man. Uh, glad that I walked into their life, man. Over and over, man. You know what I mean? You know, the boyfriend and the baby daddy and them, they couldn't do nothing. Mm. You bring stability. I have, man. Right. How often would girls leave and just leave the life altogether? I mean, the name of the game is basically cop and blow. You know, I mean, I mean, you can have a bitch five minutes, man. You know, that's why you got to, you know, constantly uh, uh, be on the move about yours. Uh, and, you know, keeping these women around because they can blow up and, you know, make shit difficult. Um, you know, you might have a, a jealous bitch that, that uh, you know, bitches will run bitches off and, and yeah, you know, all kind of different reasons why, why uh, well, motherfucker end up holeless, man. Well, you know, like I said before, you're really having a relationship with, with these women. So you are sleeping with, with these women also. I mean, you know, they, they had a fun. Right. You know what I mean? The pimp ain't no porn star. You right. know what I mean? Uh, but, uh, yeah, it's, it's more money than sex going on. Exactly. Because they do that all day. So if they could come home and, and, and doing that too, well, shit, you know, I mean, you know, you like God to them. You know, I can touch God whenever I want to. <laughs> I can get God to do this. I can get God to do this. Dang, you ain't, you ain't God no more. Mm -hmm. And a bitch think like that. You know, I always think like that.